extra layers, haven't we, Jane, over the past few days? And in fact, you might want to bring out further layers over the next couple of days because, yes, things taking a decidedly wintry turn out there at the moment. Many of us seeing some wintry sunshine around, but there's also some heavy showers here and there through the course of today. So they've already been falling across parts of northern and eastern Scotland. Wintry over the higher ground, some rain showers too at the moment down the east coast of England. Also one or two through the English Channel and around the Irish sea coasts as well. But yes, over the next few days, really for the rest of this week, things are turning even colder. And for some of us, some snow showers and some icy stretches around too. Some really frosty nights on the way. And that's down to the fact that we're drawing in these northerly winds bringing this cold air mass so the blue colours streaming right across the UK. So for the rest of today still a few showers around particularly around parts of eastern England, northern and eastern Scotland, snow over the higher ground but increasingly to low levels later on in the day and temperatures today only about four to seven degrees feeling a little cooler if you're exposed to that breeze close to the east coast. But those temperatures will fall quickly once the sun sets Clear skies for many of us, showers just easing but continuing just close to the east coast of England once again. Could be some icy stretches also for northern and eastern Scotland. But look at those temperatures even in some of our towns and cities down to around minus four degrees. So certainly a sharp frost to start your Wednesday. Now Wednesday we can follow our isobars right back up towards the Arctic and again some of those wintry showers around, particularly for parts of northern and eastern Scotland. Could be about two to five centimetres of snow at low levels there, perhaps a bit more than that over the higher ground. Again, it's largely rain showers close to the east coast of England, but a little bit of sleetiness as some of those move inland. But for the vast majority of people, it's going to be a dry, sunny, cold day though. Top temperatures between about three to six degrees, but feeling colder when you add on that wind chill, particularly cold around that east coast. So feeling around about minus two for the likes of Aberdeen and Newcastle as well. Heading on into Thursday now, and we've got a bit of a frontal system moving its way south. So a bit of uncertainty on the detail for Thursday, but there could be some snow flurries, perhaps a bit of sleetiness apart through parts of Northern Ireland, perhaps into Wales as well. Again, icy conditions around some of those coasts and more snow across the north of Scotland. So temperatures at this stage only about two to six degrees. It could turn even colder than that for Friday and into the weekend, Jane.